Okay, welcome. This is the May reading for um, the Sagittarian Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Um, thank you for the positive energy vibration. Like, share this reading. Um, it's going to be a good month for you, Sag um, Aries. So, um, you Aries, whatever is happening, um, it's going to be um a um good month for you guys it is the energy of strength and with the energy of strength what transpire is that this is going to be actually helping you guys out so please like share these videos and thumbs up let us know what's happening i've changed up the form of the reading so by changing up the form of the reading there is going to be different things that is coming out so um leave a message to tell me how was this reading and we are going to go in the reading so i will see you guys later okay so you aries let's see what's coming up for the aries for the month of may um 2019 it's going to be a fire energy a lot of fire a lot of positive energy so for the aries we have justice is coming up whatever the situation is whatever is transpiring for the aries sun moon arises in the first week you have an air sign now whenever the sense of justice comes up i think i should be um like putting it this way i actually did it this way so let me let let me know how it is second week we have justice against the lovers now um, this could be legal issue um, if you were divorcing if there was situation that was transpiring um, it could affect you guys in the third week you have the energy of the Empress whatever the situation is whatever that is transpiring it has to do with financial um, situation and you have the energy of the organization so for most of you it has to do with um, most of you um, are going to be having situation to do with legal issues with your partner. Um, it could be divorce, that sort of a thing, that form of a thing. I'm seeing heartbreaks, but you guys are going to be getting over the heartbreaks, whatever it is, whatever the legal issues is. There could be some heartbreaks for you, Aries. So let's go in the angels of the Aries to let us know what is this justice against the lovers? What exactly is transpiring and happening? Listen to your own intuition about the situation. Whatever that is happening and transpiring, your intuition is going to be guiding you about a relationship or something um, that is taking place. We have the energy of the hamper, and this is an effect of your work. Um, this is work situation, but um, this is the center of... Uh, um, the month for you guys so it's going to be affecting because this is the energy of the Harris victory and success is definitely going to be coming so whatever the situation is whatever is transpiring you're going to be victorious and successful over a situation that has transpired and has taken place in your life whatever the situation is or was you are going to be justified because of whatever the injustice that has happened it is going to be um, a month where a lot of situation is happening the hermit is here again the hermit and the eye princess is here because you are going to be um, going through a lot there is going to be a transition that is happening for you Aries and the transition could be coming up against or at your work so you Aries there could be a transition there is a lot of people um, who are working against you but this is going to be coming to an end so whatever that has transpiring and that was happening at your work um, you guys are going to be um, really having the effect of a lot of um, uh, situation that is coming in um, and uh, whatever that was um, affecting things around you now there is definite justice coming in and it could be justice against you so you Aries so whatever that you have been doing whatever that has been transpiring in the lives of you Aries because here is a situation with the organization and this is going to be coming to an end 
whatever that was playing and whatever you Aries have done this is going to be coming out in this month of May you're ending the month that um, you are going to be having a transition you Aries so um, definitely I'm seeing um, some of you had a situation with car problems and organization and um, um, if you had a situation with a car problem in the month of April this is coming out in May and especially in the last week you're not going to be having that luck you Aries and this is for you Aries that has had car situations or legal issues it's not a very positive you Aries so whatever that was transpiring I'm seeing the energy of the lover and a situation that has to do with work um, there is um, success um, for people who have been being very honest and working on a positive sense okay and that could be coming out in the second in the third week going in the second week but whatever the situation is and whatever that has been affecting the whole situation is that now you're seeing that definitely some changes is coming in to know who what is going to be transpired it is good to check out the extended reading um, you Aries do not check use the extended reading but it's going to be good if you guys do that in this month because with the extended reading you are going to be better capable of um, be aligned and aware of what exactly is transpiring so um, abundance wise some of you ladies are going to be working very hard some of you ladies and that is ladies 45 years and older could be making it um, good in the workplace um, some of you not all of you um, whenever it comes to love and relationship it is not the time um, for that um, that is not going to be um, one of the most positive things that is going to be happening listen to your own intuition whenever it comes up to relationships I'm seeing a focus of most of your most mostly focusing on things that is more positive in your life and that is the way to go let's see what else is coming up for you Aries you have um, financial and materialistic changes is coming up for you Aries so whatever the situation is there is definitely financial and financial changes that is going to be coming in your life okay what else is coming up for the Aries the end of a situation that is transpiring um, whatever you Aries has gotten yourself in in uh, April for some of you there was some heartbreaks and you could be getting over this heartbreaks there is an extended deal of this reading where the love is going to be coming up so you will know definitely a lot of people are going to be ending relationships a lot of divorces are going to be happening the Emperor comes back up authority so some of you are dealing with people in authority and um, whatever the situation is because I'm getting something with some of you had had a situation with a car and um, this is affecting you Aries for the people and you're not going to be coming out as the positive because of whatever the situation is it's as if you have gone through the situation before and uh, it is not going to work out and especially for the young Aries I'm seeing that whatever legal issues you have it's not going to be very positive coming out for you young Aries okay let's look at the energy for the spirit guides what animal spirit guides is coming up for you Aries we have uh, the pelican spirit let it shine the pelican spirit let it shine and for a lot of you older um, um, people whatever the situation is and this is only for people who are vibrating on positive energy who have done things to help society or help out other people some of you are definitely going to be caught up in a situation where you have done some injustice and you um where you have done some injustice to someone else and this is going to be caught up on you okay so um, you guys know who you are whatever has transpired whatever injustice you have done against someone um, it is going to be a returning to play out in the month of May there is a lot of positive energies and these are coming up for the, the for 
people who are very positive, people who are um, vibrating on a positive energy vibration. And this is good because what is transpiring here is that you are seeing that a life and situation is definitely going to be aligning with you and the positive energies. Um, you guys have for the affirmation I open my heart um, to love and healing from uh, the um, the Pleiades the Pleiades okay and this is um, another spiritual group that comes in the Pleiades is all about love so call upon them to help heal your heart because definitely there's going to be some heartbreaks um, for you Aries and I hope you guys are seeing um, I hope you guys are really seeing this because there's definitely definitely going to be some heartbreaks um, for some of you Aries okay whatever the situation is is that life brings positive energies sometimes not all the time and you have to work with it because whatever you give out is what you're going to be receiving and that is how the universe works because if you have been giving out positive energies then the universe will return the positive energies to you if you have been giving out negative energies that's exactly what is going to say a lot of you are going to be dealing with authority um and um what is going to be transpiring is that there is an end, an end to a situation that is coming and you have to learn love. Number 38 is here again, the number 11 energy. So a lot of you in authority um, who is dealing with situation with uh, legal issues or authority and that sort of a thing, definitely it could be um, that whatever is transpiring in your life is that you have to pay for some karmas. There are things that you have done um, without other people knowing and you have to pay for your karmas number 38 the earth healing is coming up for you Aries and the affirmation is that through unconditional love I am empowered to love my divine divinity I rest um, my gifts and talent I know that all I need for divine success uh, shall be um, um, provided for me I now choose of my own free will to release any blocks um, or unconditional consciousness of holding around me and releasing anxieties the hurt is here to help us all to relieve that what I am capable of I have attained so far and how much I can offer to the hurt I live from my heart with absolute trust may all beings know that genuinely the hurt in the world have confidently to express their grace through my own free will so be it what I'm receiving also is that there are some of you that has done some injustice to other this is going to be coming back to you it's not a beautiful message but it is what is given for you Aries use the energy of the Palladians because they're going to be helping you to touch open and activate your heart chakra and you will be um, okay ladies and gentlemen please pick up the extended reading namaste until next time